All right, the Dukes of Hazard, the legendary General Lee. Uh, this particular 124 scale die cast was made in 1999. The value on these General Lees, they're going up. They're going up more and more and more. And one of the reasons is because of this top right here. And this top here is not a decal. This is actually painted on, which makes it even more valuable. Um, you know, we live in a modern society, uh, political correctness. Um, they don't want these made anymore with uh, the Confederate flag on the top of the car. Uh, not going to get into the debate of the Confederacy and all of that. You know, I believe that there are many um, African Americans that fly this flag. I, I know it for a fact. You know, they had ancestors that uh, fought in this war as well, you know. And we live in a politically correct world and society where they want to almost erase history, you know. Regardless of what the Confederates fought for, there was a lot of bloodshed and we need to respect that, you know. So, anyway, this is a 1969 Charger, was the General Lee. Uh, in the filming, just some quick history on the Dukes of Hazard. over 300 Chargers were destroyed uh, making the series, you know, all together. Uh, they used a lot of AMC uh, am uh, ambassadors to kind of trick people a little bit. They went as far as to put notes on people's uh 69 chargers uh asking to, to buy them because they were running ended up running short on uh cars to use uh the jumps the car of course being front heavy they had to add a lot a lot of weight to the rear end to kind of level the car out in air you know so uh 1969 charger just a regular old jump it's front heavy it's gonna nosedive so they learned that real quick so anyway <clears throat> this is a um, 1999 die cast is a um, 124 scale some really nice detail on it I really really love this car this car is probably worth a little bit of money I would have to go and look oh my god it's windy out here Shed doors are flinging around. So you got the fan, the transmission in there. The block is painted red. And uh, we look underneath here, and you can see some really nice detail, man. 19, uh, 2002 Warner Brothers, but if you look up here, it's kind of hard for you guys to see. It does say uh, racing... Uh, let's see, Racing Champions 1999, so I would assume that's when it was actually made. You see the transmission there, and the dual exhaust. Got some chrome headers there. It's really a nice die cast. Uh, the front wheels, of course, turn. Or do they? No, they don't on this one. Take that back. Nevertheless, if you can get your hands on a General Lee, girls and guys the, the value as the years go by especially if you got the confederate flag painted like this one is on on the top the value is going to go up so very nice die cast used to watch the show as a kid still watch it today one of the most iconic cars in uh the history of tv man the General Lee, 1969 Charger. Alright guys, if you like this video, click on the bell to the right to be notified of all my future videos, as well as when I go to a live stream answering all your questions on NASCAR, racing, God, Scripture, Dallas Cowboys football, Texas Longhorns football, a number of different topics. And be a part of my Pick 5 contest that I do for NASCAR where you can win die casts each and every week. Subscribe, be a part of that. And uh, check out JB Racing News Reviews. You can win die casts uh, through his contest uh, weekly. As well as Thor Sith and Charlie NASCAR. You can win die casts uh, through those guys as well. You guys uh, 
Thank you for watching and take it easy.